Today in Minecraft, we grew up from babies in daycare to being kids in school. And then we became adults. And finally, we got really old. Oh, Melon, my back hurts so much. My brittle bones hurt so much. And if we can get 5,000 likes on this video, you guys can turn us young again. Whoa, thank you so much. We're back in action. <laughs> Good. Good morning, Melon. Oh, good morning, Sonny. Another day in the life of being a kid. It's so awesome. We have so much fun here. I know, bro. Our daycare center rocks. But Melon, where's everybody else? I think we overslept. Oh, no. Sonny, did they abandon us? I hope not, bro. They've got to be downstairs. All the other kids have got to be here. Hello? Guys, we want to play. Sonny, they're all gone. Wait, what the heck? Look at this guy. They removed his head. No, Melon, that's a toy house. Relax. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I see that now. It kind of did look like a hairdo on top, though. I won't cap. Oh, well, Sonny, I'm glad at least they're not all dead. And the great news is none of the teachers or babysitters are here, so we can play and do whatever we want. Let's go. It's gonna be so much fun, bro. Look at this. We've got a horsey. I'm gonna ride one. I'm gonna ride one of these boys. Yo, Melon, look at me go. Bro, you you're doing great, Sonny. You're so small. Wait, what the heck? How did that horse break that? I, I don't know. He kicked out the ladder, but I've got it now. Oh, that was wild, dude. I'll put the ladder back. There we go. Hey, Melon. <laughs> Check this out. Scrambled eggs in the face. Ow! That's it, Sonny. I've had enough of you. I'm going down the slide. Alone. No, no, no. I said alone. Okay, okay. Alone with me. No, no. Get, get Scram, bro. <laughs> I'll wait at the bottom then. <laughs> What the heck, Sonny? What is this? Yo, this looks like a secret exit. Maybe this is where everybody went. Bro, you might be right. <gasps> I've never seen the outside world before. I want to see what's beyond these walls. But Melon, I have a feeling we need to find four items to unlock this doorway. Hmm. Four items? Ow, what gives you that idea? Well, there are one, two, three, four item frames, and the door's locked. What else could those be for? Oh, you're right. Sonny, let's look around. Maybe there's some keys somewhere. Yes, I'll keep my eyes peeled. We have the cubby holes and the TV nap room. Well, if it was upstairs in the TV nap room, I hope we would have noticed. Sonny, I'm gonna check the toilets. You check the barrels. Uh, okay, those are not toilets, are they? I don't I don't know. They look like toilets. Uh, those aren't toilets, bro. Those are those are desks. These are our workstations. Bro, did you forget? We literally had class yesterday here. Dude, I'm like three. I don't have a great memory. Oh, yeah. I was doing some learning here while you were put in a baby chair and you were forced to eat mushy peas. Whatever, bro. I'll check the barrels. Jeez. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These are the cubby holes. I'm telling you, there's probably some loot in here. Uh, backpack. <gasps> a key, Sonny. I actually found a key. No way. What does it look like? It looks like a key. Oh, yeah, you're right. Well, why don't you put it in this item frame? Let's see if anything happens. Hey Whoa, it worked, bro. We just need to find three more. Sonny, I'm gonna check the real toilets. I don't understand your obsession with toilets. Just just go do what you gotta do. I'll look around down here. I know for a fact. One of these keys is in the toilets. I just feel it, Sonny. Feel it. Yeah, what? Someone pooped in a toilet and they dropped a key? Uh, maybe employee bathroom. Alright. Toilet, toilet. Yo! What did I say, Sonny? I knew there'd be a key in here. Bro, that is so weird. Wait a second. I remember Mr. Steve saying that he was gonna eat the key so no one could get it. But I guess he pooped it out. Yeah, this is pretty gross when I come to think about it. But whatever. Sonny, it's time. Key number two! Yeah! All right, Melon. There's another place I want to investigate. Right down here. The secret basement. The forbidden area of the daycare center. Yeah, it's about time you do something, Sonny. I've been finding all the keys. Yeah, whatever, bro. I just found a dead end. There's nothing here but three more item frames. Bro, how many things do we need to collect? Um, Sonny, you said there's three item frames down there? Yes, bro. And a wall that we can't get through. Well, Sonny, I'm seeing three player heads. Hold on, let me check. Let me investigate this. Uh, Melon, Melon, I'm stuck. I'm too short. Pull me up. Throw me a rope. Bro, just jump up, dude. I'm too small. <sighs> I'll bring the heads. Just chill right there. Okay. Wait a second. You're right. So green, red, yellow. Remember that combination. Yellow, green, and blue. No, no. Green, red, yellow. You can't mess this up. Green, red, red in the middle. 
Melon, don't ruin this for me. This is my moment. Red and yellow. No way! This chest, the key, key number three. Give me that. Let's go. Yes, I've got it. I can't wait to put it in the item frame. I want to see the sparkles. Whoa, it worked, bro. We just need one more. Bro, where would this last key be hidden? Hold on, uh, let me check something, Melon. Look at me. Yeah, uh, just look down a little bit. And K, okay. is it in there? Is it in there? No, no, it's not in my head, Sonny. Okay, I just had to check. You can never be too sure. <sighs> Sonny, are there any more toilets in this daycare? Bro, you are so weird. Whatever, just go check whatever toilets you want. Look, there's a toilet out here, I think. Yeah, see the horses? They're standing in the toilet. Mm, let me check. That's actually a good point. Maybe the key is somewhere hidden in the big toilet. Melon, I was kidding. That's a swimming pool. It's not even a toilet. Uh, it could be a toilet. You don't know. You're gross. You pee in the pool? Uh, sometimes. Whatever. While you're checking that, I'll look elsewhere. There's gotta be... <gasps> Melon! I have an idea! I have an idea! What's that, Sonny? You know the entrance to our daycare? What if we broke out and checked that tunnel? Oh, you're right. I didn't even think about that. Yes, I can break the glass. I'm out of here. No way. Now, Melon, looks like there's a secret down here. We've got to follow this ladder down. Please tell me the fourth key's in here. Whoa, what is this place? I have no idea. The heck? How is this in the daycare? I don't understand. And and why didn't they let us come and play here before? This looks so much fun. And very dangerous. Very dangerous. Be very, very careful here, Sonny. I'm gonna go invest in a gate below. Yeah, I'll complete the parkour. I'm actually the goat for these jumps, bro. These jumps are tricky. Bro, it's so weird down here. It looks like there's an iron door right here. There's some weird, suspicious ladders. What the heck? Where does this lead? Whoa, it goes deeper? Well, I'll check the high ground, Melon. I've just gotta make this jump. Yes, I'm up. I actually did it. Yeah, Sonny, there's nothing down here. I'm really confused. Well, up here, there's a problem. There's an iron door, but I have no way to open it. Huh. Are you sure there's nothing down there? Are you capping? <gasps> Melon, there's another secret area. It's right underneath me. Check it out. Uh, where do you see this area, Sonny? Bro, go down there. Whoa, you're right. And there's a chest, Sonny. It has a cobblestone and a stick. Yo, you could craft a lever with with that and then we should be able to open up this iron door oh you're right that's why there's a crafting table bro hurry up make that lever and get up here come on bro it's time for the lever sonny i'll make this parkour don't you worry i believe in you and if you fail and splatter like a smashed watermelon i'll pick up the lever and leave your body behind that is very very descriptive and a little bit gross and scary it's not my fault dude you're gonna splatter bro how did you make this jump? Yes! Whoa, I did it. Nice work, Melon. You didn't even go splat. And all I gotta do, lever right there and open. Let's go. We're in. No, 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 no. Chill. Stop. Stop. Okay, chill, bruh. What is this? There's more secrets? What in the heck, Sonny? Bro, I didn't know our daycare had this much lore. Uh, what do we do here, though? I don't understand. There's gotta be something around here. Yo, Melon, hide and seek. Can you find me? Yeah, you're, you're right there. Yeah, good job. Good job, Sonny. Good job. Whatever, bro. There's gotta be... Ooh, what's this? Secret, maybe? No, there's nothing there. What if these torches? Maybe one of them's a lever. I don't know, Sonny. Just go around and click on things and walk into walls. Yep, I'm way ahead of you, bruh. Melon, I found it! This wall right here, dead ahead. No way! Wait, there's not a key in this chest, but a piece of paper with coordinates. Bro, how difficult is this last key to find? Bro, they don't want us to escape from daycare. This is crazy. Melon, you need to go to coordinates. X-axis is 5952. The Y level is 50. And then the Z axis is 812. So 50 is just one block above me. And what's the what's the what's the other one? I'll do it. Don't worry. Here or something? Or is it over here? Yeah, five, five, nine, five, two. And then yeah, eight, one, two. Wait, is it just up this ladder? Are you kidding me? Yo! 
The key! We found it! Let's go! Sonny, we gotta get out of here! Yes, Melon, the fourth key! Open up! It worked! The door! Let's get out of here! Freedom! Uh, but, Sonny, who's gonna care for us and give us food and, like, love us? I'll love myself. I don't need anyone. Well, I guess we're gonna have to take care of ourselves for the next little while. Ten years later. Yeah, Melon, another day in paradise. Uh, yeah, but unfortunately, our paradise is about to come crashing down, Sonny. It's our first day of school. Oh, uh, summer vacation's over already? Yeah. Give me my backpack. Fine. Uh, Melon, let's just get to class before we're late. I don't want to get detention again. <sighs> What do you- Detention- Sonny, it's our first day of school. Of this semester? Bro, you don't remember? We've been going to school for 10 years. Oh, yeah. I forgot. I don't blame you, Melon. It's been a rough 10 years taking care of ourselves. All we have is Quandale as a pseudo-parent. Well, he does do a pretty good job, Sonny. Melon, we've got to hurry. This is our first day of finance and business school. I want to become rich. I need this. I've got to learn more about money. There's nothing more important in life than money. Yes. Yes. Good morning, class. Our first lesson is about microeconomics. Dude, I don't know if I can sit through another second of this. It's so boring. And when are we going to get to the part where we're rich? She wants us to invest and slowly work her way up the corporate ladder. Like, are you buying into this? Melon, I don't think our other classmates like this very much either. I don't think our other classmates are conscious, Sonny. Yeah, come to think of it, they kind of look like bots. Maybe they're paid actors. I think we should probably just ditch class. This is just boring. Yeah, bro, well, but what do you want to do? Uh, I'm thinking maybe we feel a little nostalgic today and go play at the playground. Don't, don't you think we're a little too old for that now? You're never too old to have fun. Having fun is an excellent way to lose money. If you want to be rich, you must stop having fun. Yeah, Melon, this class is cursed. I'm out of here. Let's scram! Bro, this place is awesome. It reminds me of our daycare. Yeah, dude, this is like a way cooler playground, though. It's for big, grown-up teenagers. Yeah, we are 12 years old now. Johnny, I'm 13. Bro, I'm 12 and a half. Okay, relax. Bro, I'm going across the monkey bridge. This place is so cool. Check this out. I'm going down. Uh, uh, Sonny, do you see this? Bro, there's just a chest here. Whoa, what's in there? There's a map and a shovel. What's it say? What's the map say? Bro, bro, there's an X on this map. It's like a map of the school and like some other building near us. And then there's an X. Dude, that means treasure. That's where we can get rich. We got to find this X. Yes, yes, we're going to get rich the fun way. Come on, come on. Where's this buried treasure? It's right back. Oh, X marks the spot. Here. Dig, dig, dig. Oh, is it right there? No, Melon, dig, bro. Oh, sorry. Sorry, sorry. Uh, hold on. X is... It's actually gonna get right around here. Melon, just dig deeper. How deep do you want me to go? At least two or three blocks, bro. Check out, see if there's a chest. Come on, think about it. If you were to bury treasure, would it be one block deep? Yeah, probably. Dude, you are stupid. Let me see the map. Okay, fine. Let's see. According to my calculation, the treasure should be right about here. Melon, dig right there. Dig right there. Yo! Let's go. Secret buried treasure. Dude, it's a book. It's just a book. Who the heck wants to read? I don't believe you, Sonny. There's got to be diamonds in here. No! 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 My shovel broke. <sighs> Anyways, I guess I might as well read the book. Melon, we might be on to something. Page one says, want to get rich? Yes, absolutely. Page two, find the forbidden book of knowledge hidden in the library, but be warned, it's heavily guarded. Don't get caught. Yo, Sonny, this is it. This is how we're gonna make money the fun and fast way. I don't know if it'll be fun or fast, Melon, but I do know we've got to find that forbidden book and obtain the knowledge. Let's do this. Here it is, Melon. The Forbidden Library. It says no 
students allowed? Or, or brokies? The heck? Yo, what? It really is protecting the secrets of how to get rich. Yes, Sonny, we've found it. Now we've just got to get the book. Look, follow me, bro. This easy, dude. Look, this place isn't even guarded, dude. There's no one here. Uh, did you hear that? Uh, sounded like a villager. Oh, yo, Sonny, Sonny. If we want to get this book, we're going to have to take him out. Melon, I see the chest. That's got to be where the book is. Dude, I can't open this chest. It's locked. Bro, it's because the guard's right there. He probably has the keys on him. You're right, bro. We're going to have to find a way to take him out and get the key off of him. I've got an idea, Sonny. I'm going to send you upstairs. Take all the sand. Okay. Melon, I made it. I'm on top of the roof. Now what do you want me to do? Okay, Sonny, I'm going to want you to break the netherite brick. There's a lot of netherite brick, bro. The whole roof is made of that. Okay, okay. I see your name tag, Sonny. Just, just go just go forward a little bit. Forwards. Uh, Start breaking the block. Yeah, yeah. I think, think right to your left. The block right to your left. This? Is it cracking for you? Yeah, I think that's right. That's the block. That should be the block. No way. Okay, okay. I'm breaking in. And then I guess I'm going to jump down, surprise the villager, and take the key? No, 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 no. Use the sand, Sonny. Take him out with the sand. Wait, Melon. You want me to kill him? No, no, no. Not kill him. Suffocate him first and then kill him. Oh my goodness. Bro, I don't know if I'm ready for this. Grow up, Sonny. Don't you want to be rich? This is how they all do it. They commit murder. I don't know if that's true, but they commit murder in Minecraft. Let's go. Yes. Yes, it's working, Sonny. Yes. He died. Come on, please tell me you had a key. Yo, he did. Let's go. I'm coming down. Sonny, it worked. The forbidden book of knowledge. What's it say, Melon? I've got to know what's in there. The fastest way to earn money is in the Pacoville city. But you need money in order to get there. Wait, what the? This is so stupid. I need money in order to get money. I guess that's what our teacher was talking about with investments. <sighs> Many months later. Finally, Sonny, we made it to the big city. Bacoville. Let's go, bro. We're gonna be rich now. So, Melon, where's our apartment? Uh, I don't know yet, Sonny. We have to go to the city hall to get our new address. There it is, Melon. City hall. Let's go. Uh, Melon, I don't think you should drive your car in there. No, obviously I'm not, bro. I'm an adult. I wouldn't do that. Melon? Melon? See, I'm an adult. That's why I stopped right at his doorstep. That's perfect. Hello, City Hall, Sonny and Melon here. We want to get our new apartment, please. Yes, just come to my office. Oh, hey. Hello, Mr. Mayor. I don't really know who you are. Welcome to the city. We've reviewed your application and decided to accept you for three months. You have until then to prove your abilities and demonstrate that you can stay here. We've also prepared an apartment for you. You can go now. Passcode is 1712. Melon, this is amazing. Mr. Mayor, you're the best. Here, have all my emeralds. You deserve it. Sonny, that's... Oh, we have... Had left. It's fine. We live in the big city now. We'll be rich in no time. Sonny, you're telling me we get this entire building to ourselves? I don't know if it's the whole building, bro. It's apartment one. Oh, yeah. We, we just get the bottom floor. I'll still take it. And he said the password was 1712. Yo! Dude, this place looks awesome. Apartment one. Key card. I got it. All right, Sonny. Take us to our beautiful establishment. Yes, a brand new penthouse suite. Look at this place, bro. Dibs the bathroom. Uh, okay. Dibs the bedroom. Let me just get rid of Sonny's bed. Oh, yeah. I'm taking a nice old steamy poo. Close the door, please. If we're gonna be roommates, we've gotta be civilized. Yeah, sorry about that. Appreciate the privacy. Look, I even lit a candle so that it doesn't stink too much. Bro, we even have our own flat screen TV. We cannot get kicked out of Pacoville, Sonny. You're right, bro. We need to get jobs as soon as possible. Sonny, I've got got an amazing idea for our first job. Okay, what's that? Stand up comedy, Sonny. Uh, Melon, I, I don't think this is your strong suit. No, 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 sit down, trust me. I'm gonna make you guys all laugh. Okay, let's see what you got then, bruh. Okay, okay, guys, 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 hear me out. Why did the melon break up with the watermelon? Because it wanted to be single-seated. 
<laughs> I'm sorry about that. Um, okay, okay, let me try another joke, okay? You know, you know, the first ones always don't go off too well, but, uh, here we go. It's all about delivery. Why did the melon go to jail? Because it committed a melony! <sighs> That's his girlfriend. He just can't help himself. Why did the melon go to the wedding? Hello, anyone? Anyone who want to answer? Probably because he wanted to be the melon of honor, or the melon man, or melon something. Yeah, you actually, melon of honor. That was, that was the joke. Get off! Off the stage! No! No! This was my calling! Don't worry, Melon. <laughs> You've got a professional here. I'll handle this. <clears throat> Good evening, everybody. <clears throat> my name is Sunny. I'm here for your entertainment. And I just moved into town, so after I knock your socks off with the greatest comedy performance you've ever seen, I can rock this comedy club every night. <clears throat> Anyways, uh, first joke, first joke, yeah. Why did the Melon bring a ladder to the comedy club? Because Melon is so much... Funny high, uh, he's high on the funny rank. Because his jokes were too low. <laughs> Why are you laughing, Steve? Why? That wasn't even funny. Okay, okay. <laughs> Great crowd tonight. Great crowd tonight. Yeah, so uh, <laughs> I got another one here. Why did Melon try to become a comedian? Anyone? Anyone? Alex in the back? I wish he didn't. I hate Melon. He sucks. His jokes are so lame. Yeah, Alex, I hear you on that one. But the real answer is he was trying to turn around his CD reputation. Reputation. <laughs> Come on, that one doesn't even make sense. Oh, fantastic crowd. I've got one more here for everyone. Why did Melon get kicked out of the comedy club? Oh, oh, I know this one, Sonny. Yeah, what is it? Because he blew the whole place up. No, Melon, no, don't do it. <laughs> get out of here now. Melon, I can't believe you. I was totally going to land that job. Mm, probably. <sighs> Anyways, let's try something else completely different. Today, we're gonna become nurses or doctors or nurses or dentists or whatever this place is. Hello, yes, I would like to become a nurse, Nurse Melon. Great, we are in need of some assistance and you've arrived just in time. There's a patient upstairs, take care of him. Oh, Melon, how hard could that be? Not hard at all, Sonny, not hard at all. Oh, Mr. Patient, we're here to take care of you. Hello, hello. This is, this is a lot of stairs, dude. Oh, Melon, I found our patient. He's right in here. Bro, what is wrong with his head? Melon, it's fine. That's what we're here to help with. So, Steve, I just need to ask you a few health questions here. Uh, what kind of pain level are you experiencing right now? My neck is so sore, I think I'm dying. Gah! Uh, Melon, he's in serious pain. We need to find a health potion. Sonny, Sonny, right here. Splash potion of healing. I've got him. Oh my, thank you. That feels so, so much better. You guys are the best. Okay, Steve, that's great news. And and I need to also just ask you to test your memory here. What did you have for breakfast this morning? Sonny, I gotta go to the bathroom, bro. If you need the health potion, it's the one on the left. Okay, health potions on the left. Yeah, so Steve, about your breakfast. Oh, I think I had a ham sandwich or something like that, and- Ow! My neck! It hurts again! Oh, Steve, I'm sorry! I got you covered! I'm not Nurse Melon, but I think I can figure this out. I think you said potion on the right. Yeah, potion on the right. Here you go, Steve! This should help you feel better! Ah! Uh, Sonny, what have you done? I was trying to enjoy my dump, but now I'm poisoned. What the heck did you do? Uh, <laughs> I gave him the potion on the right. That's what you told me to do. I said, give him the potion on the left, you idiot. Steve, Steve, I'm so sorry. Do you have any last words? I hated your stand-up, Melon. You suck at comedy. No, Steve. I always hated that guy anyways. Well, Melon, I'm pretty sure we're not getting this job. Well, Sonny, since we killed Steve, no one wants to hire us. This is our last chance. What could possibly go wrong? I'm gonna be rich, bro. Give me this jackpot. Jackpot, jackpot. Later. And I'm broke. <sighs> Sonny, what are we gonna do? We're gonna be kicked out of here in no time. Don't worry, bro. We still have over a month left. We can turn this around. Well, Melon, we're still broke in the world's richest city. Yep, and we have about one day left here before we get kicked out. Actually, we have 23 hours. <sighs> Sonny, we are so done for. I want to take one last good look at the city before I never see it again. I'm with you, brother. A final stroll. Oh, I'm gonna miss this 
place. Apartment one was so beautiful. Hold on a second, Sonny. What about apartment two? Yo, there are key cards in here. Melon, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yes, we return their key card and tell them that it was in an unsafe place. Actually, Melon, I wasn't thinking that at all. I was thinking we rob them, take all of their furniture, all of their valuables, and we sell it to the black market. Oh, oh I like what you're thinking, Sonny! If we couldn't get a respectful job, at least we can be the city's thieves. Somebody's got to do it. Sonny, give me everything! Yes! Bro, their couch and table's even nicer than ours. Yo, I'm gonna even steal their sink. Sonny, you're not gonna believe this. Yeah, what is it? Look at their toilet. Don't tell me you pooped in it already. No, no, no. Look at the toilet, Sonny. <gasps> Golden toilet! We're gonna be rich! Yeah! Okay, if they have a golden toilet, I wonder what's in their bedroom. Melon, you've got to see this. What even is this? A crying sword? Ow! And a crystal sword. Ow! Melon, these swords, they've got to be worth a fortune. Even more than that gold toilet. Nah, Sonny, nothing's worth more than a golden toilet. Hello? Is anybody here? We were told this is where you take illegal assets to sell. Sonny, if this was a place to sell illegal stuff, you think they'd just do it out? Out in the open? Oh, you're right, bro. It's probably upstairs in the private area. Ooh, how did you know what that said? It, privé, private, I don't know. Sounds about right. <gasps> I was right! The salesman. Hello, sir. Yes, I may or may not have come across a golden toilet. That's cool. I'll give you three gold blocks for it. Dude, that, that's the same thing. I tried to tell you, Melon. <laughs> now let's see what a crystal sword sells for. No way. A crystal sword? That's worth billions. Melon, did you hear him? This thing is worth billions. Billions with a B? I've got a crying sword. Oh, that one isn't worth anything. What the heck? Don't worry, Melon. At least you can dry your tears with it. So, yeah, here's that crystal sword. Now make me rich. Melon, we're rich. I've got to go store all my diamonds in the bank. Yo. No way. Sonny, can you please share some of the diamonds you got? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't mind sharing just a little bit with you. There you go. Yes! Now that you're rich, Melon. Melon, what are you gonna do? I have no idea, but I do have a date with Melanie. See you later, Sonny. Wait, what? Bro, she's clearly just interested in you for the money. Not true. I'll show you wrong. <laughs> Sonny, why are you crying? <laughs> it's just so beautiful. <laughs> Seeing someone take advantage of you like this even more than me. What are you talking about? She loves me for who I am. I love you for the way you, um... You may now kiss the bride. <gasps> are you ready, Melanie? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sorry about that, guys. I looked away as soon as I could. Much, much, much later. Ew! That's it. I'm out of here. See ya, Melon. I'm not coming back. You're not my friend. Mm -hmm. I don't even care about you saying... Mm -hmm. One eternal later. Oh, my back. This was quite a journey to make it to the daycare. I haven't seen you since the wedding, Melon. How's it going? Oh, it's so good of you to come, Sonny. Uh, it's going pretty terrible, actually. Melanie left me the day after. I tried to warn you she didn't love you. She also took all my money. That's why I'm living at this old abandoned daycare. I thought I recognized the place. Oh, my knees. Well, Melon, I'm sorry you're such a brokey. I still have so many diamonds. That is very cool, Sonny, but I invited you here to share my last meal. Last meal, Melon? Why the last? We have so many great years ahead of us. No, Sonny, I'm sick. The doctor told me I'm past my expiration date. You do look like a terminal melon. Yes, anyways, the last supper is in the basement, Sonny. Oh, I've been so lonely for these past 30, 40 years. I don't even remember. It's been over 85 years, actually. Oh, well, Sonny, come down here. I must show you the last supper. Melon, this is not a good meal. I don't like this. No, Melon, Melon, no, I don't like this. I don't like this. 